Why do you think like that? Art you do becomes your children. People didn't look like the people I drew, but I liked the art anyway. I didn't care what it looked like. The teacher thought so too, and my artwork usually went on display. Most kids got discouraged if they couldn't make a tree look like a tree or a person like a person. They quit, they gave up, they beat themselves up. I made a Virgin Mary at Lewis and Clark School. It went on display for parent, teacher, student night. My mother was very proud of me. The teacher was telling my mom what a good artist I was. I got embarrassed and said something like, Mom, I can still see Mary. 
She was a very beautiful blue clay figure. I'd always make fake dentures for my father out of clay when we worked in clay. I'd put in a tongue and paint it all red and white. I'd give it to my father for a Christmas present. Ow, 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 ow. I think I gave him four or five sets over the years. I paint and draw because I like to. It usually comes over me, although I can do it even if I don't feel like it, except when I'm too tired. Salvador Dali is my favorite artist. I was probably 12 when I saw a book of his work. Even though art was my best girlfriend, I didn't know art until I saw Dolly. Dolly was art. Dolly is art, then Bukowski is words. I read Bukowski in 71 and wrote him. He wrote me back. I like the way he drew birds. I copied, shamelessly copied, the way he drew birds. I drove Bukowski around in 75. He said I was his biggest groupie. You ponies! Last time I saw him, my brother Leonard and I were helping him down five flights of stairs in Canada. He was drunk, calling us phonies and trying to deck us. Bukowski is my favorite author.